Hey folks, it's Rithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Graveyard Keeper. So, we've actually finished Graveyard Keeper. We, we, we've done everything that we needed to do in this game. But there are still more things that we can do. We can keep going with our zombies and building things up here in the graveyard. I'm just going to go to here and I'm going to stop him from making those now. Um, we're going to go and we're going to have a little wander up towards the beehives. And we're also going to gather up some of the wood from there and bring that back down. Just because otherwise it's in the way. Uh, see, we've still got four of them there. Well, five of them actually. Um, and we're going to bring... So we, I, I want to work on the graveyard a bit. Maybe get some more points on the graveyard. Yeah, I should... Let's, let's get these bats... I really don't like bats. Nasty little critters they are. Nasty little critters. Uh, yeah, we can do a little bit of work on the graveyard. We have actually finished, though. We have actually finished. And we have actually gotten everything that we can get, uh, with the, at least with the story. We've done the story. But what we still need to do is we, we want to sort of build the graveyard up a bit. And the other thing that I'd like to do is... Um, this is going to be my final episode now, by the way. I started a poll on... Seriously, I've got no bees. I normally get bees. I was hoping for one more. I need one more. I just want one more bee. Um, I'm, I've also been doing a poll on the channel. It's been running today. And it's looking like people would like me to play Shopkeep 2 as a replacement to this series. That's okay. We will go and play Shopkeep 2. I'm quite looking forward to being able to play that game. Um... It's one that we, well, we've done a little bit, didn't we, a little while ago when it first came out. But we haven't done anything to it for ages. There's been loads of updates to the game. There's been loads of stuff added to it. So it is looking quite cool. There is a load of stuff extra in there, um, which we'll be able to go and take a good look at. And then I'm hoping, you know, once we've played through it, I don't know how long we'll go with that one for. But then we'll see once we've done that. Uh, we'll have a look around and we'll see if there's any other games that we want to play. There's one that, that has been suggested to me that looks quite good. It was one of the options that I put up for the poll to, you know, see if you wanted to have a go with it. Can we do anything with these? Can I pick these up? I don't think I can. Uh, you know, I can't actually remember what it's called now. It's a, it's like a mining... Um, type game with a robot in it and it was somebody suggested it and said this is a really cool game it's great fun to play I uh, really like to see you playing it and I've had a little look and it does actually look quite cool so I've gone and bought because it's on um, on sale on Steam at the moment I don't know how much longer for so by the time this episode goes out uh, it may not be available. It's normally the game is six pounds and is currently one pound seventy. So I thought oh, that looks pretty good. I'll, I'll I'll have a go with that, um, and you know, we we can try it out. But it, it does look like it might be quite an interesting game. There's a there's a, um, a a second version of the game has been made, so there is another another version of it that is now available. Um, and I'll see how the first one is received. If if we do go and play the first one, I'll see how that's received, and then we'll go, you know, possibly go on and play another one as well. It could could be fun. Uh, I want to go with you right there, and then make that one infinite, and then I want to go back to that one there like that, and I want to make that one infinite as well. So that's going to start doing those, and then looking in here, I got twenty six jars of honey. I'm going to eat. I, got, I picked up another bee. I didn't even realise I had. I've got a little bit of flesh right there. I actually, I, I took it from here and I just cut it. It was so that I could sleep after I'd made my last episode. Um, I'm going to wander down this way a minute. I'm going to go through the darkened corridors down here. We don't need to worry about any of these people anymore. We don't need to worry about the, the quests or anything like that. That's, that's all done and dusted with for now. It's 28. I've got six of them there. Six bat wings. That's loads. That's millions. Right, let's put you into there. And then I go to that one and I'll drop that in. I've got a candle I'm wandering around with. Plus I've got the prayer as well. Those two I'll take over here. I'll probably... Actually, I don't want to pick them both up, do I? Um, 
Right, that, I'll take the goo and then I'll leave the candle and I'll leave that one behind as well. Just got to try to remember to actually take that candle with me. And you there I will destroy. Yes. And the hunter's medallion I can leave down here because we don't need that unless we're planning to go into the dungeon again which i'm not planning to do in today's episode and so yeah today is probably going to be the final episode that we do for a little while we're not going to come back to this game for quite a while now um it's been a lot of fun i've really enjoyed playing this but if you count all the stuff that we did in the alpha as well as all of the episodes here we've done well over a hundred episodes of graveyard keeper which is quite a lot of time to spend in any one game so it, it is probably time for us to move on now and, and find something new something fresh to play uh i got those i'm gonna need flitches and nails i think to make the beehives so we'll go up there and get those um if we can start getting a few bodies together so that we can improve the quality of the graveyard a little bit uh i'd like to also maybe make some more columbariums if we can um, that means more bodies coming. Oh, hang on. No, I needed nails and I needed flitches. Um, and some extra money. Just having some money available would also be a useful thing. So that when there is a DLC, because they did talk about doing a DLC. Uh, so when a DLC does become available. I'm not I'm taking like 300 nails here, but that's fine. I don't know if it's flitches or if it's boards. So I'll take both just in case. Um, when a DLC becomes available, we should then have a load of cash available to help us enjoy said DLC. So let me wander down into here. I'm hoping that the four zombies at the moment have got all the seeds they need in order to be able to do anything on here. I've got that one right there, some lentils, and there's those, and then there's some onions. i got enough to be able to do two lots of all of these. So we'll just let those carry on there, and we'll wander up this way. Going back towards those beehives. We're going to drink a couple of beers along the way. That's going to keep us going. And we can build our second bee. We got we got um we got bees now. So we can now build our second beehive. See that one's they're, they're buzzing, but uh, you gotta look for according to Gooseman X, you gotta look for the little symbol of the, the honey. You gotta see the honey just dribbling out the front, and that'll tell you that it's ready. There oh it's four flitches and six nails, that is all. And then the, the, the 10 bees. I don't know why you've got a big square there when you can only put down a little one like that. Who knows? Right. There's another one done. Get you built. So, yeah. Uh, uh, if we've got money set up, if we've got it set up so that we can earn a little bit of money, just, just to start with, I feel that that would be quite a good thing because it will prepare us for if there is a DLC ever released for the town. I really hope that there is a town DLC um, a town DLC, that would follow on from what we've done, right? That that would be a follow-on story. It's got to be. I mean, I I cannot see that it would be different than that. You know, you, you'd have the, the town and then we'd have our lost love. You've got the people that are back here and they're doing all their stuff over here. Um, and our lost love would come and join us and then we would do battle with what's going on in the town. The great plague that is going through and is causing all sorts of trouble and grief. Over that side, uh, we, we definitely want to do something to be able to improve matters. Now, we've got a whole load of 11s in the graveyard now, haven't we? So I could dig up some more graves. I've still got room for digging up completely new graves, adding more in. But I don't want to actually do that. What I'd like to do now is I want to start replacing some of the bodies that are in there with 12s. I still need to be making more statues. So I've got these two here. Um, yeah, they're, they're waiting, aren't they? Because uh, I can actually craft with that. So they're they're busy waiting at the moment. So I want to take you. And I want to be able to get another four bodies that are ready for autopsy. So we've got in here, this is five, which is not very good. That's plus four on that one. Um, so if I take that dark heart out, it's not. we're not going to be left with very much at all. But five is too many. Five is not very good. Thus... A red and a white there. Well, let's remove that brain a minute, because I might be able to do it with the brain, I think, on this one. We may be able to. So now we've got four and we've got two. So add three onto that becomes a nine, because we've got a six. So that becomes a nine, and there's no change on a nine. 
Um, but insert here, if I've got... I've got a double white there. Let me just put that one in a minute. Let's, let's, it, it's easier for me to look at it. I can look at it like this. Right. So we've got an eight with a, four reds. An eight with four reds is not so good. Um, no, this isn't going to work. An 8 with 4 reds means an 11, and it's still, yeah, and that would stay as an 11. So if I remove the dark heart, I'm just going to have 3 whites on here. So what about intestines? Let's remove those intestines right there. I'm thinking we'll probably have to burn this body. Either that, we'll have to take the heart out. I suppose I could take that heart out. I could just do it with a different one. I, I do have other hearts that I can use. Uh, that's minus two reds and plus three. That's a pretty good one. That is a pretty good suppressant type one. Um, see, I've got loads of plus reds on it. Let's, let's try that one. Let's just see what that one does. Whether this will work. Because uh, the suppressant one does seem to work a little bit differently. I think you've got to add in some reds in order for it to work. And I'm not quite sure how it does it. Um... Right, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So then that becomes an 11, there's a 12, there's a 13. So now we're wasting that brain. That that brain is now being wasted. I don't want to waste a brain. So if I take those two whites out, like that, we've got 2, 1, 2, 3, 4. We've got a 6 and 2. That becomes a 9. Um, and a 2. So no, a 6 doesn't work anyway. So I've got that one... I'm going to put this one in now. So this is... We should have three reds in here. We've got three reds. Right. One, two, three, four, five. And then we've got three reds there. That makes eight altogether. So then if we uh, do the autopsy stuff, that becomes an 11. And then we can do one more. Right. So uh, slightly less quality uh, brain in there. That works. That works. Don't worry. I know, I know what I'm talking about. I know what I mean on this. So we keep the one white intestines and the two white brains. Those are both pretty good ones. Uh, and really, we just kind of want to wait now. I do need some more sand. I need to get... Right, I need to get some more statues being made up this way. And then I also want to get some more sand. That's another thing I'm going to need. So you are quite busy at the moment anyway. Let me have a look in here. What have we got? What have we got in the way of statues? I've got nothing there. I've got nothing there. I've got nothing there. I've got no, 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 no. Right, I've got gold and I've got copper. That's all I've got. Gold and copper. I've got a whole load of those, though. So I, th those grey fences I do want to remove. Um, but no, I want to go to there. 23 of them. Oh, I know why I wasn't doing any more of these. Because I haven't got any silver steel chisels at the moment anyway. So let me go to here a second. And I want to make some of these. I can make two of those. Make that one. There. I want to make two of them. Like that. Right. I'm out of there like that. And then just work both of these. One and two. Right. Job done. Now I can have a look in here, and I can drop both of those steel chisels in there. I'm going to... No, I'm I'm going to dump those. And that. And that. And the ceramic jugs as well. Get rid of everything. And then we go along over here, and we take... What am I wanting to take? There was something that I wanted to get. There was something very... Oh. I think I wanted to move some of those. I do. I want to I wanna remove some of those. And those. Not that one. That one. And those there. Right, so I've got a whole load of those. I'm going to run these down to the bottom. And leave those in the other chest. And then I want to come back up and I want to get the fences for the graveyards. And we're going to put those, the, the, the graveyard fences, up there. Uh, drop all of those in there like that. So they're now ready and waiting. And then I want to get the fences, and I want to take those across. I'm also going to order a statue be made as soon as he's finished doing... Actually, it doesn't matter if he's... Uh, we'll, we'll leave him go. We'll leave, we'll leave him to work. We'll leave him to work. Uh, there, grey fence two. That's the ones that I want. Right. Lots of grey fence two there. Let's 
Nothing there for me to take, and nothing there for me to take either. So, in order to be able to make four statues, I do actually need 40 uh, faith, don't I? I need 40 faith to be able to make four statues, because I can't just... I've got to make the first statues, and those require five faith each anyway. So, it, it's not the cheapest thing to go and do. Right, now, drop as many of the... I can't drop all of them in. Well, that's a bit of a jolly nuisance. What else can I do? I've already put the grave mark. I've already put them down. I've already put fences on all of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No more over there. Nine. <laughs> I've actually got too many. I've got too many fences. I've got no use for all the rest of the. Oh, uh, and that one right there with that one is. I'll make ten. But uh, I've already got ten in there. I've got too many fences now. It's my next problem. So I'm running around with too many of these. Oops. I'll go and dump these in a chest and we'll leave them there. We can do something with them another time. Maybe in may, maybe the game expansion will allow us... Will give us a bigger graveyard or something. You never know. It, it could be like that. It could just be that we get a bigger graveyard and we do more to it next time round. Right. You have now run out of things to do there. So that means I can go to that one and I can go... Craft like that. Okay, you need to halt and it picked up another one immediately because the zombie I don't know if you've seen him. He came in he crept in Just under the wire and put another one going Which wasn't very helpful to us. Never mind. Okay, uh, that one Nope This one Yeah, that's well actually no this this 50s all the way through uh, I'll take that one out and you Take that one out I want to try and like put some of these together, so I put that together onto there, uh, just just to make things a little bit tidier. I got twenty, I got two of those there. I got three of them. Is there any? I haven't got any more, unless I've got some up over this way. Ooh, put another one of those going. In a second. I want a carved marble there. See, it takes five of them, so I craft that one. I get that one going. But then I got to do another five in order to be able to get the next lot going as well. So there's nothing in that chest. Where did all of the little bits of timber go? I've only got two there. Two. There's none in that chest. There is. Oh, there's 16 there. That's what I was looking for. And then those three right there. I want to put those over there. So now we've got a bit more space. More and more space coming through. As soon as this one is done, I will craft another one. Then. Our body should have turned up, so we can go and deal with the body. We may also be able to know that the, the zombie gardens are not going to be ready yet. I'm going to leave the other gardens. I'm not going to worry too much about them. Let's go back into crafting in here. I want to go to that one and craft you. Uh, that's going to make three of them, I'm hoping. Let's take a little mosey on down here. Let's we'll see if our don There's the donkey. He's turning up. Comrade donkey is all ready to go. I did. Re I loved the ending, by the way. I absolutely loved the ending on this. It was. It was not quite what I was expecting. I mean, I suppose I should have been expecting something like that. But that just to have them say, "No, that's it. The capitalist pigs that made the game are going to um, cash in on some DLCs and stuff like that." Genuinely thought that was really cool. I really did. That was. It's, it's been a long time since I played a game that uh, had a bit of trolling from the devs of the game to the person that's playing it uh, right at the end. And I thought it was a nice touch. It was, it's been a long time since I've seen something like that. Uh, right, what do we got? We've, uh, we've only got two in there, but that's a five. So if I, I make this into a seven, so I want uh, white hearts in there, or oh, white skulls rather. I put whites in there like that, and that's going to give me now a 7 with 2, so then that becomes a 10, and then that becomes full-blown. There, that's, that's everything that we want. So we 7 with 2, that's what we want. So put you into there. I think I'm going to now need a load of sand so that I can make some more glass, so that I can make some more of these, because I don't think I've got enough stuff to be able to do more injections. So we'll get those first injections going there. Then we'll go running along here, and I've got a dark heart that I'm carrying around, which I now want to put into there, like that. Craft. And... Yes, I want to go and have a look at the injections, and I want to see what I've got. 
I've got lots of fat here for candles. I've also got those candles there, which are doing great. You get two of them for each one. For, for your efforts, you do get two. Uh, white paint and four bees. Good gravy. That is an expensive way of doing it. It's the conical flasks. I got water, but it's the conical flask, and I don't have the glass for it either, so I need to go and get a load. Of, I need to harvest a mountain of sand. That's what we're going to need next is lots and lots of sand in order to be able to get a load of flasks. And that's going to be that's going to be ready for getting our next lot of bodies. Probably not going to have to worry about them in this episode. But, I mean, it would be nice to be prepared. It would be nice to have something there ready. So let's take a little mosey on up through here. And in round that way. Weave in and out. The only thing I haven't really done much of in this game is the fishing. I did a little tiny bit, but I didn't like fishing. I didn't didn't really get on with that at all. That one and one more. There. We now have 300 sand. I'm hoping that 300 sand is going to be enough just to keep us going. I'll put 100 sand into each of the furnaces. Although that's probably going to take up more time than I really want it to, isn't it? Uh... Should I do it like that? Should I should I do that many? Is that really is is that going to be a sensible thing for me to do? A hundred, oh, mind you, because I've now like I've I've improved the amount that I can do each time. I can yeah okay I, I'll put in a hundred sand. We we'll go we'll go ninety six. We we'll go ninety six sand in each. That's sixteen lots. That's actually sixteen minutes. So it's going to be probably by the end of this episode I should think. Um, that's fine. We've at least got glass being made. It's, it's going to be... I've actually got some conical flasks that I can make right there. So I can put a load of them in here. 16 lots. Let's go all of them. Uh, right there. 19 lots of conical flask that I will put into there. That lot is now ready and cooking as well. I want to go to that one. I want to go to this one right here. So I will drop the rest of the sand in there. That's ready then to use. Uh, right, that's everything. That's everything that we want to do. We'll go and sleep for a minute. We don't need to go and see anybody. We don't need to worry about that. The only thing that we want to do is we'll want to say prayers on the prayer day. And I don't think we've got anything else that we need to worry about too much, have we? Just saying the prayers in order to get the money. We could also do with just running up the road and checking on the... Um, oh, what's his name up there? The merchant up the road. I don't think we actually had anything that we want to sell this time, though. I don't think there was anything up there ready to sell. The zombie here... He needs... Yeah, you do need to give him a little bit of a nudge, don't you? He's only got 5% work efficiency. Who have I got over here? Let's let's have a look. Right, you are 10%. You are... Oh, you're 20%. Right, let's have you. You'll work a little bit faster than this dude down here. You... No. Take. Right, dump you down there. Put you on there. That's a bit better. Look at that. Way faster. Okay, and then I'll bring you along this way and I'll dump you onto there like that. And there's our next body, all ready to roll. So we're not like, I don't think we had anything at all with the merchant. I don't think there was anything down there that was um, going to be ready to roll or anything like that. So I'll run you back this way and drop you in there. What do you got? You are a seven. No, yeah, you are a seven with three. That makes a ten. Uh, that'll become an eleven. So... We need to remove one red skull. I've got a red white. I've got a double white. I've got a double red and white on the brain. Um, let's take that heart out there. I'm going to replace that with a different one. Go back into here and then we have a look down here. So I've got a single white. I've got a double red. I've got a double white. That one's one of each. So I want a double white on this. Using up my double white there. I don't know if I want to be using up the double white. Because it's quite a good one. But that now gives us a 7 with 2. Which makes a 10 when it comes out of the embalming. And then you take those two out to make a 12. So that's the perfect body. We want 12s. It's got to be 12s all the way through. Go back to our embalming over here. And I want that one. And then I want that one. And then you as well. 
that, and then finally you as well. There. Then I've right, I've got some conical flasks, so I can get the conical flasks and I can put them over here. I'll drop that in there a minute. Uh, I've got a regular heart right there, which is one of each. Yeah, I can, I'll burn that one. Uh, I'll, do, uh, I'll deal with that one. I'll process it. Oh, no, I've only got two flasks. I thought I had more than that. No, I've put a load of flasks making, haven't I? I haven't actually got them yet. Right. It'll be worth remembering that in the future. You over here. Yeah, you've got a ways to go. Okay. Ignore all the rest of that. And we head back over this way. I've got... Zombies now that I can put going in the garden down here. That's going to get me some more stuff from the merchant. Uh, right there, pumpkins, and there, pumpkins, and then there we've got uh, lentils, and we've got lentils. There we go. You are busy making stuff enthusiastically. You've got a thing of pumpkins to do. The rest of it, you don't have anything. And up here, I've got... Quite a lot of stuff. I got some more flasks. I got some more glass up there. A load more glass from that one. Right. What else do I want to do? Oh, I know. I know. I know. I need to go to you. This is going to use up the last of my faith. Yes. The last of it. The very last of it. So let's go to you and we'll take that. I've only got 11 of those left. Right. Let me go and have a look now. On here, I've got... Oh. Five, two, and three. Have I got another one somewhere? Have I got another one that's been dropped somewhere? I've got loads of silver come down. Like, seriously, look at all this silver that has come down. I don't think i got any more gold. I got the sulfur right there, but I don't think I've got any gold. No. So it would appear that zombies don't get you gold. That's, that does appear to be a thing, whereas zombies don't get you gold. You've got to go and get your own gold. I mean, it is still a rare spawn, but, um, yeah. It would appear that zombies don't actually go and get you gold, which is a little bit of a shame. I was kind of hoping that they would. I, I can't help but feel a bit disappointed by that, that, that zombies don't get you gold. I thought that they would have done. Let's drop that into there. Right, now, what do you got in here? We've got three of them. I got five of them, and I got three of them. So I actually need one more statue in here, which I don't have the faith for. Because one of those statues that I asked to be made, that came out as uh, the, the wrong one. Uh, yeah. So I need that on there. We can't do that until prayer day. Some more glass in there. I'll just hold on to it. It's fine. I'll hold on to it. So I can't put more. I can't put more stuff into the graveyard yet. Our bodies down here will be ready to go and do stuff with. So let me go into here, and we can do the next lot with the embalming. So we go there, and we do the silver one. We do you there. We do the silver one, and we go to that one, like that, and we go to that one, like that. Right. Next, I'm going to go here and, yeah, uh, use. I'm going to go to the dead horse. First, I'm going to speak to Horodrick and I'm going to sell all of these here. I've got 20 of them, which is pretty good. There's 30 silver. Thank you very much. Uh, the meat stamp, by the way, trade on here. Oh, it says 10 on there, but um, yeah, th that's coppers. You, you get hardly anything. Somebody was asking how much you get for it. It is literally coppers. It's just not worth doing. Uh, somebody was, th there was a thing that somebody was wanting was acceleration. Right, I got zero in here. I got nothing at all. Not getting anything for that. But we do have some now ready for next time, which is quite cool. Um, acceleration powder. They wanted me to make some or an acceleration potion at the alchemy table, which was blood and something else. I can't remember what else it was. I think it did take acceleration powder. But, uh, yeah, that's, that's one that they've asked if I can make. I think it was Eric King, was it? Asked if I could make this before I finish up this series. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to go in here. I don't have acceleration on here at the moment. But what I am going to do is I'm going to have to go and look it up. Right, speed potion is what you wanted me to make. 
So we need in this first one, we want to come down here, we want acceleration powder. And then the second one is chaos solution. Which is that? That's the last chaos solution that I've got. I'm going to do something about that. Uh, chaos solution and blood. Blood for the final one. I got lots of that. So we put that one into there. Oops, no. I'll work that one. Right, uh, the chaos solution. There, speed potion. We now have speed potion. Effect on use increases your speed. So I'll drop that one down there. We will use that one in a minute. But first up, I want to go up here. So it's, no, it's not that's powders in this one. It's over here and it's chaos that I want from here. So where do I get it? Is it the bat wings? Are the bat wings the ones? Yes, it is the bat wings. We use the bat wings on here. That gets me the chaos solution. So I want uh, I want a couple of chaos solutions to go back into our um, chest down the bottom, onto, onto the shelf down there. Right, there's there's a couple. There's six of them. We keep us going for a bit. Drop you into there, and we've got those. Right. I got one, two, three, four, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of them. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I've got two of these that I don't have. Slowing. I, I don't have slowing solution. Uh, I've got toxic. So I've got those. I've got order. And then I've got death. Death there. Death powder. Uh, but I, health. Yeah, i got health. I don't have acceleration and slowing. I don't have he acceleration and slowing solutions. Well, uh, never mind those. Right. So, I want to come out here now. I've done those. What are you? you oh, actually, you're ready for more embalming. So, we'll go there like that. Craft. And then we'll go there like that. And we'll craft that one. And we'll go there and we'll craft that one. Like that. And we'll do the same to you. Right. There. We have now crafted a whole load of them. We should be getting a body turn up any minute. I'm not... I'm going to... I'm going to use that slowing thing, but I'm not going to use it just yet. I'm waiting for the optimal time. There's the body. And I'm thinking the optimal time is when I want to run the bodies over to the graveyard. I think that would be the perfect time to be using them. So bring you over there. You are going to dump in another one. And then I can go and check this body out over here. Right. Somebody said that they, you know, that there seems to be an awful lot of bodies coming out of the town. But they're, they're goblin bodies. You know, they're, they're in... They're, they're, in a constant war against goblins, and so you're getting all these goblin bodies turn up. That's that's the simple solution to it. That's 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 why we're getting all of these. Um, no other explanation is needed. Not really. <laughs> right. Um, plus white. I could just remove that one, except that that's going to leave me with just three. I'm thinking that one should be burned. I'm thinking that would be a body that would be best to be burned. We could take the dark. Do I want to? I will. I'll take the dark intestines out because that'll become powder. And I'll also take. I've got a heart there. That actually. Okay, well, it's a bit late now. I've taken it. And then you. You're just a plus one white, which isn't actually very good. There's not a lot that I can do with that. So I'm just going to take that body out. I'm going to dump it there a second. I'm going to run back over this way. Uh, what did I take out? Have I got a heart in here? I do have a heart. That one can go in there. That one can start working. And then I've got over here, I've got the dark intestines, which I'm going to drop in there. We'll very quickly turn those into powders. We've got four death powders. Drop them in there like that. And then we will go and we will take this body down to the fireplace. So we'll grab you, open up, and then I'm going to drink that one right. Oh, nice. Oh, very nice. I'm liking this. We work faster as well. Every, every, it's 10 minutes as well. This lasts for 10 minutes. Empty table. This lasts for 10 minutes. This, this is brilliant. Why didn't I do this before? Why did nobody tell me to do this before? I know Eric King has been telling me nearly every episode for the last 15, 20 episodes to do this. And I've been saying, yes, I'm going to do it. But why didn't you make me? Why didn't you force me to do this? Because, uh... I, I, I didn't do it, and now I regret it. Look at this. Look, we got 10 minutes of this. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. 
This is so much better. Right. So my plan is actually I want to go to the grave. I want to rip that one up. I want to remove like that. There. See how quickly we do this. And then we go over to here. We go exhumation. Two, three. Let's, let's take a few of them. Right. I want a few of those. There. So now I can exhume the bodies. And I go to you. I take that one out. Okay. And... Uh, F, I can do that very quickly. Right, so then I'll take you up there and I want to inter that corpse. Like that. And then I can go onto the grave. I can put the grave fence back on there. Where it's supposed to be. And then I can also go and put on a gravestone. Except that I have no gravestones available. This is not good. Right, but I do have one available over here. That one is a death statue. And I need a death statue. Go to that one and remove that marble statue there. With this wonderful, wonderful speed, but I, I need more of these speed potions. This, this is my entire game has just been changed. This is literally one of the biggest game-changing things I have found so far. So if we run over here, can I turn this into a 12-quality body? That's the next big question: is can I turn this into a 12-quality body? I got two whites on there. I've got a red and a white on there. This is an 11 at the moment. So if I take that one out, what have I got in the way of um, stuff over here? So the, like the brain, I've already got a two. Uh, I don't have anything I can take out there. Right, I've got plus two of each on those. That one is plus two reds. I could take that one out and I could put a plus two reds and a plus a white in. And that would actually turn that one into a 12 quality body. Have I got it? I do. I could put that one in. That one right there. That's the perfect one. So I can take this one here out. Extract. Yes. Like this. You ready for this? Y'all ready for this? There. That one goes out there. And then that one there goes back in. It should still be... Yes, look at this. Right, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I didn't count properly. I didn't count properly. I failed at the first hurdle. Right, I'll put that one back into storage because I want to keep that intestines there. Uh, what have I got? Have I got a 2... Uh, I need a 2-2, two, two, don't I? I need a 2-2. Two, two. I've, I've got three of those. Okay, that's perfect. I can drop that one back in. There, not enough energy. Now I do. Keep drinking beer. That's the way forward. Right. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. There. We've got it. That's a 12 quality body. I've now turned this one into a 12 quality body. It wasn't originally, but it is now. That's all I need. Okay. So I'll run you over this way. And I drop you down there. So 92% that one is. So what I'm going to need to do is I actually need to very very quickly get this one open and it's a good job we've got this uh, little speed boost right here because uh, otherwise that body's not going to be much cop exhume okay take that one out and then go to you and put you in there and then bury you okay that's done so then i want to go up there i want to grab that one and dump that one down there and i want to go back to this one right here and I'm going to put that one back on. So it's, I'm literally just replacing this one. Like for like, exactly where it was. I'm putting the stuff back exactly where I found it. And job done. Right. I can take you. And this one was a 10. I'm not even going to work. Actually, I say I'm not going to worry about it. What I am going to do is I'm just going to pick that one up. And I'm going to run it up here. And drop it on the slab. And I'm going to take a look. And I'm just going to see if there's anything that I want to take out. There is actually a bit of stuff that I want to take out. I want to take out the heart, which was quite good. And the intestines, we got another um, two doubles on there. Two reds and two whites. So I'll put that one up there. I've got that one that I want to keep. And then that one there that I want to keep. I've got several of those. And then here we've got two reds. And that's just two reds. So I don't want the two reds one. What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to pop that two reds one back in here. I'm just going to put that back in there for safekeeping. Yeah, see? I'm going to take that body and we're going to take this one down and we're going to burn this body. We don't want this one. That one's going to go. So you're going to go... Nope. Pick you up. Put you on there. Then set fire to you. Right. 
Then I'm going to go back up here, and I'm going to get another one. So I've just about run out of time for today's episode, and I'm also getting extremely croaky now. You can hear it. It's getting worse. Right, I've just taken out the blood and the fat from that one. That has now become another good body. We've got the donkey moving in. So we'll just leave him go for a minute. I'll drop that one down over there. And you here are the next one that I want to do. So let's take you out. Once we've got some more statues, I'll worry about getting the other bits onto the graves. But right now, I'm not too concerned about it. We're also, now we've got an energy problem. I'm going to exhume that one there. Take you out. Like that. So then I do that and swap them over. This one's on 90%. No, don't be on 90%. 90% no good. If you've... Ah. I've lost... Wow. I've lost two on there. Okay, exhume. Um, That's another exhumation that I'm having to use up on that. Which wasn't quite part of the master plan. So that one there is no good. And this one here is no good either. But I do have an open body now. So that at 89%. Why is that one on 89%? Am I, am, am I like ticking time by faster or something? No. Oh, I do want to take that one out. A double white heart. That's worth removing. I'll have you. Thank you very much. And I will leave you behind there. And then I will go back over here. So this one here. This one's going to be burned. I don't want that one anymore. And then I'm going to go over this way and I'm going to take you. There is an injection I can do to remove the spoilage on the body. I, I do know that, but I'm not going to use it this time. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, that becomes a 12. That's actually fine. I can just leave that one as it is. That is a 12. So we can put you up there. I can take this one, empty the table, and I can go to there. Autopsy, remove the blood and the fat. I still got two minutes of hyperspeed, which is good. Take the fat out of this one as well. We're going to run out of energy very quickly now. It, it does use the energy up pretty quick now. Uh, we'll take this one out. We've got one more body that I can bring over to the graveyard. That one's got to be burnt, and that one there has got to be burnt, which we will do in a minute. I want to go over to here, and I want to put you into there. There, so we can fill that one back in, and then we'll put these two back on fence and the statue and that's all i'm gonna do and that's actually all i'm gonna do for this series i said one or two more episodes it's only gonna be the one and i'm gonna start the next episode that i do instead of um doing this we're going to go and start playing shopkeep 2 it's been quite a long time since i played shopkeep 2 but it is a good e there it is a good fun game to play i do enjoy playing the game uh, we just build up our shop, and there is a load of extra stuff that they have added into it now. So I'm, I'm hoping that we're going to be able to, like, carry on working with the shop that we already had, rather than having to start it all over again. But I don't know. It could very well. The amount of stuff that they've added, we may well have to start over from scratch. So we'll, we'll wait and see on that one. Um, but, I mean, it's... There is quite a bit, there was quite a bit to do in the game anyway, and we'll we'll see. I'm not going to stay there if the gameplay gets too repetitive and boring. There are some people who are a bit concerned that the gameplay could get repetitive and boring, and then it's, it's not going to be fun to watch. I won't stay there. If it, if it does, then we'll move on and we'll do something different. I want the... Whatever we're playing on this one, I'd like it to be entertaining. So, yeah. The shopkeep is what we're going to go for. But it's not necessarily... We, we may move on from there. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. So long, I'm hoping that everybody will actually enjoy it. Right, there is the bishop. He's on his way in. He'll be ready for a prayer day. But we're not ready for a prayer day yet. Ooh. No, because he was... I, there was one more thing that I would like to do. There was one more thing that I would like to do. And one of those things does actually include burying another body so let's go and dig up we'll, we'll dig up the lowest quality body that we've got here um i'm gonna dig up a, i'm gonna dig up that 10 over there i've got a couple of 10s i'm gonna dig that one up right there remove you take you out of the ground like that i still well i've now run out of um fast potion it's fine so let me just quickly remove this one here. No, it doesn't actually seem to speed it up very much, does it? It's just running around that it seems to speed up. Now that I'm looking at it a bit. Right, you're in 97% body. Much slower now, isn't it? 
That is way slow now, dude. Well, that's that's fine. We, we, we don't mind that. We got one body in here that we want to process. Uh, nope. Uh, let's do that. I'll bring you up here, and I can drop you on there, and I can have a look. So we've got one, two, three, four. That was a ten, wasn't it? So uh, I've already got the good intestines in there. I've got the good heart. Uh, but the brain is actually quite a bad one. And the brain is doing. That's plus two reds on there. Remove that one. This could actually, by removing this plus two reds, that could actually uh, backfire. No, it's not. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I've got 11 in there, so I only need a plus 1 white brain for this to work. And I've only got a plus 2, so I'll have to put that one in. It's going to be, it's going to give me a 13 quality body there, which I don't really want. Um, I've got the heart there for plus 2 whites. And I've got that one for plus 2 reds and plus 2 whites. What have I got here? Uh, have I got a plus, I've got a plus 1 heart there. That heart, see, that heart is plus two whites. So that's quite a good one. So if I take that one out, I'll put the plus one in instead. And they're still going to give me a 12 quality body in here. So where have we got? Uh, that one. I'll put that one in. Look how quickly I'm using up all my energy. Right, that should be, yes. That is a 12. So I can take this one and I can go and put it straight back again. We don't even need to burn this one. And then once we put this one back in the ground, we are able, we're able to put another one in if we want to. I don't really want to, though. I, I want to hurry up and get this done. Uh, we, we'll do that. We'll do our prayer, because I wanted to speak to the bishop, and I wanted to get what I can off of him as well. So put that one in there, and then we get 12 quality altogether on our fences and everything else. So we put that in. Um, that gives us 822 quality in the graveyard altogether. That's pretty good. I'd say 822 is not too shabby, really. That's, that's not something that you can complain about too much. Uh, trade. So we're now up to these candles. These are better quality candles. And we can't get the super good quality ones until much later on. I got 10 of those that I can buy. Only 10. That's 2381. So buy those. Uh, let's put my tier up to there. And then I can get 20 of them. Let me do that. Buy. It's going up a little bit. So... I can't sell the candles back to him, though, so it's um, it, it's a slow process. We'd have to do this every week. Uh, and then I want to go in here. I'm going to go down to the basement. And I want to get... I've got one candle down here, haven't I? I've got uh, that candle there. And I've also got that one. Right. I could make some... Can I make some here? Oh, no. I need I need paint for that. I need white paint to be able to do that. I can do it there. Ooh, we can get some even better quality candles. Have I got time to do this? I don't think I've got time. I want white paint. There's no white paint in that one. Uh, I don't have any white powder. Right, all right, ignore that. It's time uh, Time is ticking by. I'm going to run out of time in a minute. Um, this is the very final episode, so it doesn't matter all that much. Let's just get these candles into the churchyard. That has gone by very quickly, actually. I didn't expect it to be that fast. Right, let's put those two there. We we'll go to these right here, and these are going to be the better quality ones, like that. Look at that, it's plus six on there. And that one also is going to be a better quality one. There's a plus six on there. And then we we'll go to you over here, and we'll do that with the, the white candles. And we'll do that with the white candles on there, like that. So that's all plus fours. Then I can go to you there, just a simple craft like that. And... Please tell me I've got time to do this. I do not want to have to wait ages. Right, craft onto there. Take that one. So there's plus four. And you, there's another plus four. And you, there is another plus. Oh, no, it's plus, it's plus two. It's plus four altogether. Right. So we've now got 180. We do have time to go and do this. Excellent. 118. This is the very final prayer that we are going to be saying this is it. I'd like to say a few words. Our church is great. No. May the force be with you. May the force be with you. I really hope you've enjoyed this series. And I can't wait for a DLC to turn up. So that I can come back into this game. Because I genuinely have loved playing this game. I really have. I've really gotten into this one. Especially as the story has developed and so on. Um, 
kind of hoping that they sort of change the graveyard a bit, or maybe you get a bigger graveyard or an expansion or something um, with a DLC. That'd be quite cool. I mean, I love the, the zombie DLC, but it didn't add anything to the end of the game. It just kind of added stuff into the middle of the game. I mean, yeah, admittedly, it did make the, the middle of the game a bit faster. We got 84, 85 on there now. 85 silver right there. Plus, we got 30, 32 faith. Okay, 32 faith is pretty good as well. I'm quite pleased with that. 40 faith is what I'm... That's, that's my target, actually. Is I want to be able to get 40 faith in one go. Which, we are going to need candles to be able to get 40 faith. But, we'll, that's, like I said, it's going to be another time. We're not going to do that now. So, if you've enjoyed the episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. I really hope you've enjoyed this entire series. I, Like I said, I have had so much fun playing this game. I really have. And I'm kind of sad to see this one going. I would like to be able to stay doing this a bit longer. But, uh, unfortunately, we just, you know, we do need to move on. We, we need to move on and we need to start doing something a little bit different for a while. Uh, we can come back to this when there is some new material here to be had. And new enjoyment to be had as well. I think it's going to be great. I think it's going to be absolutely great when we do eventually get to come back here. And I am really looking forward to it. So, until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.